Well, hey guys, it's Saturday, so I'm, I'm gonna now try. One minute. Hold on, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna try flavour number five now, and, and that is sizzling steak fajita flavour. So, yeah, enjoy this video. Peace. Well, so, yep, if you haven't heard from the title, again, do us a flavour. I am trying Old Walkers, do us a flavour, flavours, and. And then tasting them and telling you what my what I think of them, my initial reaction to the crisps. So yeah. And now I've 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 tried four out of six flavours so far. It's Saturday, I've been tasting these since Thursday. On Thursday I tried cheesy beans on toast and hot dog with tomato ketchup, they were both really good flavours. And yesterday I tried two other really good flavours as well. Ranch raccoon and chip shop chicken curry. So yeah. Those were really excellent flavours. Today, I'm going to try the, far, the last two of six Walker's do as a flavour flavours. This is flavour number five, and I'm I'm, good at, and I'm here to try Walker's Sizzling Steak Fajita flavour. So, yep. So, yep. So, yep. Well, so, well, so yep, this was made by somebody called Jed, who was, he, he's already 19 as well, so, yep. Do you know what? Since I am more like the meaty fuzz, I'm really hoping to like these as well. So, and the, and the, um... Well, so, yep. <coughs> well, so, yep, I'm, so, yep, I'm um, gonna try for you today. This and I'm, with this, I'm gonna trip the flavour, Sizzling Steak Fajita, and I'm gonna try later on the very last flavour. The last flavour I'm going to try is pulled pork in a sticky barbecue sauce later on today, so yep. Well, just like all the other doers of wear packs, I'm just going to show you the packaging. Well, it is very similar to the other packaging, except it's per brown and green. So yep, it is the front. I'm just going to do it quicker this time. Maybe. Here's the front, so yep. Walkers. Vought Jets Sizzling Steak Fajita flavour with Aberdeen Angus beef from Scotland. So yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna So yep. Oh well so yep it's got the nutritional information on the front and and you know and yep so yep it's got the I'll just show you the packet first. So yep and, and I'll and on here again as usual it says the closing date. Opening and closing dates for the voting, so yep, again, I'll say again, it closes on my birthday, so yep, I'm just gonna put it like that, so yep, show that again on camera. One more time. Well, so yep, again, here's the back of the crisp, so yep, here's, it's got the same, there's a flavour, thin, but as the other packet, it's got the, all the other flavours, so yep. I forgot to mention each flavour on the back which I'm trying, the one that the one, it's, uh, it's got, which I've tested, it's got a blue circle around it. So for this one, Sizzling Steak Fajita, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but there's a blue circle around Sizzling Steak Fajita on, the, on there somewhere. So, yep. Here's the terms and voting terms and conditions on here, and nutritional information right there, again, as usual. So, yep. I'm sorry about that guys, my camera just clicked off on me, so yeah, I'm just about to show you this on the front again, just before I test it, it says images are for illustrative purposes only, right in, so yep, on the front, so yep, and I forgot to mention each flavour on the front, which, what flavour, the name of the flavour, it's in, it's got this little one, spatula type thing on the front, so it's what, I'll say it again, so it's what, what, Jets, sizzling steak fajita flavour with Aberdeen Angus beef from Scot Scotland, so yep. I'll say one time, Vought Jed, it says on the front, Vought Jed, sizzling steak fajita flavour, oh, flavour with Aberdeen Angus beef from Scotland, so, so, yep. Well, enough rambling about the packet, um, you know, so, yep. I'm going to taste these now, I hope these are really good, so, yep. I can really, I can, I, I can smell it, 
as soon as I open up the packet, so yeah, I'm going to smell these. These smell really good and very spicy as well, so I'm going to, you know. If this was a heart, you know what I could say? I could say this. I heart these crisps. Well, I will, along with all the others as soon as I tested it. So, yep, yep, a ponder a sniff. Mm hmm. Not bad. Cheers, my fellow peeps. Cheers. Mmm. I don't know. I'll have to try another one. Do you know what? These are actually not bad. I, I could re I, you know, they feel sticky. It feel it feels like um you know, it feels like I could taste steak and all these spicy ingredients what you what you usually have in a fajita, yeah. Well I, I it feels sticky and, and also it has it feels like you could also taste pepper in there as well, so yep and all the spicy sauces and herbs. So yep. Just gonna yep, so yep. These are not bad. Mmm. These are great. I'll say it once again, you know, they feel steaky, but it feels steaky and it feels like, yeah, having a real fajita wrap, you know. You know, they feel steaky and it feels like you've have, having, you've got the steak and beef in the wrap, steak, and it feels like you're having steak, peppers, and peppers, herbs, spices, and also, you know, and all the other usual Ingredients, what you have in the free to see. These are not bad again, so yep. These are great. Mm. Well, anyway, so yep, I think this is probably what one of my favourite do is a flavour flavours so far. I'll name the other few in my next video in the next clip so yep oh when you when you're when you're tasting these it feels like having you're actually having a real fajita wrap along with along with all the along with all the tasty steak the toast tasty steak the very very delicious spices the very sucky that's a very juicy peppers and every and also everything what you'd you'd have in a wrap. So yeah, also this is another great forever. So yeah, I'll be back later today to try pulled pork in a sticky barbecue sauce forever. So yeah, I'll see you later on, guys. Peace.